here. So we'll do the uh, setup now. Feel for the ASIS, anterior superior iliac spine, four finger breadths below the anterior superior iliac spine, and that's four finger breadths. And then you ask the person to lift the leg and you feel the groove between your TFL, your rectus femoris, okay? And then you will put your probe there in that groove. So, here you go, and that's your LFCN standing in front of you, okay? Yeah, fat fill tunnel, so it's triple FT, fat fill flat tunnel, yeah. that's your sort of, you know, fascia lata, yeah. Yeah. yeah? That's your, sort of, you know, uh, your lateral femoral cutaneous nerve tie, oh, yeah. yeah? That's your sartorius <laughs> muscle, <laughs> yeah? This is sartorius, this is rectus femoris, that's your tr uh, tensor fascia lata, TFL. Yeah. Yeah. And now I can scan the nerve up, and you can see it looking at much more, sort of, you know, closer and on the top of the sartorius. So let's say point of optimal, optimal visualization may not be a point of optimal blockage. So if I have to block it, I'll just go more, more, more up, and I can see that's a triangular fat fill pla place where I can sort of put the needle lateral to medial and fill that area with the local anesthetic steroid. If I have to do okay. the if I have to do the pulse star F, this is the area I will do because I can see the nerve much more clearly here. So you can actually bring the needle and just to do the pulse star F. And you can see the nerve is already divided into one, two and three branches. So the nerve is very this is one of the most variable nerves in the body. And uh, you will sort of you know the easiest way to find it uh, is is this way. As I said it's it's actually been taught by Prof Bernard Morigo. Uh, from Austria, who told me that this is the easiest way to find it. Happy with that? Right, let's go on to the